Hello, everybody. Nice to see you in again in this very serious webinar. Today, my topic concerns stages master in manufacturing and their benefits. Let's begin and hope you could enjoy this episode. For February, one relative subtle area that deserves special attention is the stitching. It may be small, but stitch is an important consideration when manufacturing fabric products. Different sewing stitches for different products offer their own advantage and disadvantage. Some stitches are better suited for style and decoration. Understanding these stitches used in the manufacturing can help you to learn more about the fabric and products. So let's unreal, unreal the mystery behind common and unique stitches to examine their pros and cons. And I'm going to share in three parts as usual. First is the commonly used stitches for display product you need to know. Then I want to share with you some special application of stitches and their benefits. Finally, further from same line for large sizes. Okay, let's start with the basic knowledge of stitches range to help you distinguish the stitches roughly. For our products, we currently use four types of stitches production. They are flexing like single stitch, double stitches, quarter stitches, and laser cutting. Single stitch is mainly for small flare like garden flare, which is concise and simple. We always use double stitches for most products you can see. For instance, standard 2 by 3 feet flag, 3 by 5 feet flag, and advertising flag, etc. As for quarter stitches, they are used to reinforce the flat and banner in large sizes. Products will be more durable under strong wind without falling off. The last one, laser cutting edge, applied to bunting flag, hand flag, and building flag. A fine edge offers nice looking for these products. Now you may have a preliminary idea of stitches we have. I would like to share you some special applications of stitches and the benefits they bring. I will introduce them one by one. Firstly, lock stitch is a kind of stitch that lets you over the edge of one or two pieces of cross for edging, hemming, or seaming. Overlocking is also referred to as overedging, mirroring, surging. Low surging technically refers to overlocking with cutters. In practice, the four terms are used in inter interchangeably. At present, we use these special stitches for our beach blanket, boosting good seam strength and fine edge, which is a good method for fabric products. For our face mark and eyes mark, we use slight edge covering. This method will cover the fabric to improve durability and comfortability. The third one will be the hemming edge for our banner. After testing and receiving clients' feedback, our workshop at 2.5 cm web to hang all around as a reinforcement like images shown here the practice is universally used in the market. Now go ahead with flag. This year, we update um, stitches from basic double stitches to diagonal line reinforcement with white pair, which provides double security for tearing from um, the strong wing. This upgrading has already received many good feedback from our customer. In the final part, let's talk about stitches for thin line and strength. Besides the common and unique stitches method, thin line is also a point that cannot be ignored. As we mentioned in the previous webinar, the mass is for material and machine is 160 to 320 centimeter. If size is over the limit, we only need several pieces fabric seam together. So for 10 backward, table curls, and large flat and banner, we will have thin lines. Here we use invisible stitches to make thin line invisible and get logo line up perfectly. 
Also for large flag and banners, high seam strength is indispensable to avoid tearing. CFM has rich experience for large flat and side flat and banner like uh, 15 by 25 feet and 20 by 30 feet. This size normally requires at least three pieces seal together as, as photos shown here. Reinforced edge and strong seam line is the vital point for lifespan. For every fabric products you are manufacturing, this will help you to have an idea of your desired stitching properties and seam strength, so as to make your products meet customers' expectations. The fabric and printing you select are not the only choices to consider when making products. Stitches play a vital role not just in seam strength, flexibility, and appearance, but also in the length of sewing cycles and cost of manufacturing. Okay, that's the end of today's webinar. If you still have any question about this subject, you can send emails to emails to us or contest us online directly, we should get back to you. Thanks for your kind patience. Wish, wish to see you in the next episode. Bye.